So we're going to talk about the MCU movie reschedule. I'm going to read this off to you guys because it's a really big pushback. All right, Deadpool 3 is coming out May 3rd, 2024. Captain America Brave New World is coming out August 26th, 2024. The Thunderbolts is coming out December 20th, 2024. Blade is coming out February 25th, 2025. Fantastic Four is coming out May 2nd, 2025. Avengers King Dynasty is coming out May 1st, 2026. Avengers Secret Wars is coming out May 5th, 2027. Comic Cuts and I have talked about this before, so I'm 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 going to give my piece, and then he's going to give his piece. We have communicated that pushing everything back is totally fine. In in my opinion, if you want to give us the best content, push it back as far as you can. I am willing to wait as long as we get consistent projects. Um, I know that next year we're not going to be getting that many Marvel projects. They're even not going to show up at Comic Con this year. Which, as I said, I'm totally fine with because you know last year they came up, promised us a lot. Obviously, you know with the with the WGA going on, the the, the Friday strike, which is halting a lot of projects. Blades got halted. Daredevil's got a, got gotten halted. Spider Man has been halted. So many other projects. I also think this is a good thing for Kevin Feige because now he can. I seem like they're taking time to really fine tune what they are going to do, and I think that we're going to be getting a, an announcement later on this year because. Obviously, we're definitely going to be getting a Fantastic Four announcement this year. There has to be because there's been so much, think, much much news going on. So. I saw so, – and, and I don't know if this is accurate uh, because I forget where I saw it, so I don't want to say if it's not. But uh, the rumor is – or at least people are saying that we're supposed to get the Fantastic Four cast announcement at Disney D23 event in September. Okay, so that that might be another big, you know, and that would be awesome to see that as well. But I, but you know, I know it sucks right now, guys. But you gotta understand the MCU. Like when you're when you're when you're thinking about this from from a business standpoint, they just had their worst season of all time. Like, and even though their movies made profit, still the fans hate it, and so you know they they have to go back and they have to figure out things as well. Um, so you know I am. Happy that you know the MCU is going back to kind of you know, and you could tell that Feige is really going back to kind of like what his old way of of uh, doing things was. Um, but I do believe that if this doesn't work right, you got to bring back Downey. You pay them whatever they whatever yeah. they need, and you make it happen. If you got to buy him a freaking toupee because he's bald, and, and get yo get Robert Downey back to eating meat because his vegan diet has him looking like he's seventy. Get him back to eating meat again. Put him on a carnivore diet. Bring back Chris Evans. Chris Evans looks great. Pay Scar Joe her, her money. Get them all back. So I also think that the the writer strike is really going to hurt them because we are already seeing delays um, happening. You know, obviously we want Marvel to be on fire again, and I think that this strike is just, you know. It looks like it's going to get extended, and because Agatha just got pushed back to, to next year, they should get rid of that one altogether. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, I think Loki's going to be a banger. Um, so I'm happy about that. So yeah, I mean, th- th- there's some things to look forward to. Um, but yeah, man, we are. I'm so ready for what we're going to see though in the uh, in the uh, future. 